Hello folks and welcome back to Dark Souls and we are here for the expansion Ashes of Ariandel. As always of course I am Falcon your host. Now I already did the first hour or so of the uh, expansion, the DLC, whatever the hell you want to call it, um, on stream. However my internet it really failed me and was really unable to keep up with the stream so we are recording now instead which is better because not only can we record in much better quality but uh, you know I can upload and have it actually look acceptable as opposed to not so acceptable um, I finished that area that I was having str uh, struggling with at the end of the episode there, uh, where I kept dying. I managed to get through it. Uh, the key was to sneak past most of the guys, get into the tower, and get up inside the tower and kill the two, um, the two snipers up there. One of them had a good tendency to pull out his sword and you had to fight him. But the other one I could sneak up on, uh, get right behind him and backstab him. And then he just fell off the cliff, basically. He fell out of the tower and died from that. Um, there wasn't a whole lot of interest in there. Um, we did find, and I think I found it on camera, we did find the Oak Shield. Uh, which is a pretty good shield because it gives you uh, HP regen. Um, I think I found that on a corpse somewhere. It actually might... That might have been in the tower the very base of the tower, I'm not sure. And then I also found, let's see, what else have we found in the expansion so far? Uh, oh, the Milkwood Great Bow, which is the weapon they were using, and fires Milkwood arrows, which have that uh, explosion that they do when they hit the ground or whatever you're shooting at. Um, I found... Where is it? Follower Javelin, which we can, uh, you know, hurl as a javelin as well as use as essentially a spear. Um, I found the Milkwood Battle Axe actually was from a corpse that was inside the tower up near the very top of the tower. Um, and this lets us do that uh, leap attack and roar that they have, which has like an AoE stun sort of around it the roar, the I'm assuming it's the roar does uh, so even uh, I don't I haven't tried it against enemies but when it was used against me when they use the attack uh, even if you're behind them it like staggers you for a second so it gives you an opportunity to turn around and possibly land a couple hits and I think that's everything I have seen so far from the expansion. I don't think I've seen anything else. Oh, we do have a piece of armor. Those boots. Uh, God only knows what the fuck they are in here, though. There's so, many, so much crap in here. Uh, I don't even know if I'll be able to fucking find the things in here, because I don't know for sure what they were called. Yeah, I have no idea. But the, uh, the follower boots, actually, yeah, that's what they are, because they're followers. Followers of Pharaon. Uh, where if, uh, Pharaon fell to the abyss, the tall, lean followers with the hollowed eyes quietly appeared in groups to hunt them down. Pharaon and its watchers fell to ruin, but the followers survived as a wandering pack of hollows. Mm, interesting. Uh, and they are in the expansion. The, the followers are the like smaller soldier guys that were near the very beginning of the expansion there. Now I also found something else, and this is the, I can only assume was the main reason to go into that area with the tower in the first place. Ah. And that is the captain's ashes. It was on the very top of the tower. Gracious, passing fine ash thou hast given. Let this ash, I only hope these. <laughs> mm. I wish she'd give, she should have given a new dialogue. That was an old old dialogue they were used. Now granted, that was the dialogue that she used for the majority of the ashes, but I feel like she should have at least given us something, you know, interesting for that. I'm disappointed that she didn't. Dual charm. Okay. 
Sable special effects. I don't know where I got that from, but sure. Dark Knight scale. Those are hard things to find. I will buy that. Fine gem. I don't really care about that that much. Let's see. So now we're down into the stuff that we might find something interesting. Saucer staff. Looking to see if there's any. Ah! Millwood Knight Helm. Cool. I will. I'm actually just gonna buy these. Millwood Knight Armor, Gauntlets, and Leggings. Let's look at their descriptions. Uh. Worn by the Knights of Millwood, adorned with antlers believed to grow from the blessed beast of the ethereal oak. When the fabled Millwood Forest was discovered, it was a vacant ruin. The only thing left was the ethereal oak stood rotting. No corpses were discovered, yet their belongings lay neatly on the ground. Okay. The char bronze breastplate and the thick black cape are adorned with the symbol of the ethereal oak. And all right then. Sure. And you do sell Millwood Great Arrows. Okay. Do I want to buy them? So they can. Oh, these are fucking expensive. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. It's all the souls I have, and I have a lot of souls on me. And that still doesn't give me the... I think the max you can pack is 700, because you... or. 699, because you can have 600 in storage and 99 in inventory, I think. Because that's how many of the other ones I have available, anyway. That is a lot. I'm not going to buy that many of these things, because I don't care that much, but... I will... Let's do buy... Let's buy, like, 150. Anyway, if I want to try the bow out, we can use it. Ashen 1. Because otherwise it's useless to us. So all that that gave us was the bow, or the arrows rather, and the armor. Uh, let's see, the follower armor. Uh, I didn't actually look at the armor very closely, so now I don't know if I'll be able to spot it just looking through here without reading everything. Oh, there's the uh, firelink armor. Do -do -do. Oh, a knight. Pretty cool. It does make us look pretty big, so I like I like that aspect of it. I like the helmet. The helmet's pretty damn neat. That is pretty cool. It still doesn't replace my favorite armor by far, which of course is the dancer's stuff, but it is pretty cool nevertheless. If I can find the damn dancer's stuff now, I took it off and now I don't know where it was. What would the exile armor look like? Huh. Interesting. The dragon scale one? I don't remember some of these armors. Oh yeah, that's the armor that the, uh, the, the one dude, just really descriptive, I know. <laughs> I know, uh, uh, shit, I don't remember what the hell he's called. But yeah, I, I know who that belongs to. Whatever, going back to that. Going back to the dancer set, because I like it. I could do some leveling, although not very much leveling, actually. Uh, I did actually do some leveling via um, the dark sign things that you can get from uh, what's his face over here, uh, because I believe you need five of them before he dies in order for the one person to stick around or whatever. I think it's five. Don't quote me on that. Uh, but we do have nine Halloween now. Um, which is just for me dying so much. Well, but I have th three signs now on me. Oops. So I will actually gain three Halloween every time I... The fuck? Okay. Uh, 
Okay. He's had some really weird error from a from an app thing I'm running on the computer there that should not have uh that should not have had any errors whatsoever, but whatever. No idea what that was about. Uh anyway, um Yeah, to get the one ending I think you need to have five before he disappears. But uh every for every one that you have that's how many Halloween you get, so I have three of them now, so I'll gain three Halloween. Uh, but anyway, that gives me... that did let me level up my... Uh, vitality a little bit more. I'm actually considering... I think I will. I wasn't initially going to, but I think I will. Uh, oh, I can... oh, oh, no, I can go all the way to 30 now. Cool. Alright, so yeah, I'll level up to 30. Uh, because that's kind of where I wanted it. And at this point, the only thing I really want to level is my endurance. But I want to be able to level it a lot. And that does use up the majority of my souls, so it's less important now if I die and die again. Uh, especially since we've been dying a lot, so... I have a bone shard? Interesting. Okay. Uh, so we are going back to the Rope Bridge Cave, which was that second one where we kept spawning at at the end of last episode um frankly it was no in fact it was probably a, a longer run from that one than it would have been from the other from the other bonfire really but whatever i would have had to fight more things well maybe this doesn't look very safe but that looks like there's a light down there coming from that one, br the one uh, branch. I don't know if you guys can see it, but that branch that's like right between the ropes there, looks like it has light on it. I wonder if we end up down there. There's definitely an item on that lower, like right above the rope now. There's an item right there, like right where the the rope tie is. I can get the camera to go right. Yeah, right there. It's right above it. It's interesting. So we definitely do end up going down there then at some point. It's like a fucking church or a castle or some shit up here. And yeah, this this definitely reminds me of that area. I think it was the I think it was the second expansion that they released for. Hello. Are you a bad guy? I don't trust you. Oh, you're them dudes. You're transforming the weird dude things. Interesting. I don't trust you guys. I don't trust that you're not gonna transform and charge me all at once when there's like five of you. Or some shit. You just end up destroying me. Don't trust it. So I'm not going to uh, risk. I'm not gonna risk you. Gaining up on me and jumping me all at once. NPC right there. Okay, there is something over here. A hollow gem. I don't remember what a hollow gem does. Something sounds big and nasty. Who are you? Well. Oh. You look to be unkindled. That's a voice. <laughs> no bell tolls. And yet you've slipped into the painting. Oh, no matter. Hey. If you've lost your way, the words of Lady Frida will guide you. Now go on inside, you show respect, and listen carefully. Hey, so. What's keeping you? Show respect, and let Lady Frida speak. What's keeping? Show. I. I, I don't think I want to show this person respect or listen to what she has to say. Really don't. I, I just don't. I don't. I don't. I don't trust it. I don't trust it, and I'm almost certain that I don't trust it for good reason. Oh, what the fuck is with all the paintings? Why are there like a thousand paintings of you? What the shit is making that smashing sound? 
I'm swearing a lot. I apologize, but I think I, I think it I think this this whatever all this is warrants it. What the hell? Nowhere even to go. No, but really, there's nowhere to go. This just ends. Welcome to the painted world of Ariandel. Yeah, okay. I am Frida. I have long stood beside our blessed father and the rest of the forlorn. Sure. The forlorn thou seemeth not, Ashen One. I know not the missteps which led thee to this painted world, but thy duty is all. And thy duty lieth elsewhere. Well, you're right about that. Return from whence thou camest. Well, I mean... I presume it visible to thee. The bonfire here in this room. A meek and faded thing. But twill guide thee nonetheless. No, 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 no. We, we, could, ex we could return. Sure, sure. But I, but, I, but, but I would explore more. There's more in this place to do and see. Ah, yes. There is a thing thou shouldst by rights possess. Uh-oh. Ours is a chance encounter, to be sure. But perhaps it was meant to be. Uh-oh. Let this be a remembrance of this cold world. A thing to help thee bear thy duty. Uh... Ooh, chill my rain. Return from whence thou camest. Thou'st a place in that world, and that alone is cause to rejoice. No, 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 no. Thou's to play. No, thou's to play. What the fuck? Call bullshit. This is, what is, what is this rain? This is frost resistance. Does it have a description of interest? Native Karam increases frost resistance. This rain would never grace Freed's hand for the painting and its frost became her home. So, oh, there's a. So, is me using the thing? No, no, it doesn't. No. You're a highly unhelpful woman. Well, that ring doesn't really do much for me, so I'm not actually going to bother with it. But you, you have anything to say? Lady Frida has spoken, has she not? Then tarry no longer and be gone. You all are really unpleasant. There is one thing you sh inside the cold painting. Curiosity could be your cross. Stray from the withering flame, and the snow will swallow you whole. <laughs> okay. There is one thing you inside. <laughs> I mean, if you want me to leave, I don't know why you're trying to give me, like, a, a tip. The objective is for me to leave this place. I don't know why you're trying to get to help me get around it. Give me, like, some sort of clue or something. What the fuck? That was concerning right there. We're already inside the painting, aren't we? So... Like... I don't get it. So why are we about to do something with the painting here? Fuck. I don't fucking get it. What the hell am I supposed to do?
now, thousands. get it man it's just like uh we leave and then we somehow get pulled back into the place or something well like we try to leave and it doesn't work and technically you came you told us to return to where we came from so let's go back and talk to that other dude like the guy who sucked us in here the hell, man? Okay. So... What am I supposed to do now? What am I supposed to do now? somebody there to talk to. I don't get it, because as far as I know, I've explored everywhere that there was to explore. So unless that one dude who, like, sucked us in is in here somewhere... I don't get what I'm supposed to do. Like, at all. Mm. And fast on the trail, then these red uh, Use them to what else are under. <laughs> you're an old NPC. One that I needed to talk to, but. What else? Pillage embers, what else? One that I needed to talk to, but. Not. What I'm looking for. No, but seriously though, what the hell am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do now? Because we've done... As far as I know, we've done everything that there was to do. Okay, nobody up top here. What the hell? There's definitely more to the DLC. What the fuck are we supposed to do? Seen you before, seen you before. I know both of you. What the hell, man? I don't get it. Stupid people trying to call me, sell me shit that I don't want. Or just otherwise do shit that I don't want anything to do with. Stop calling me. Okay, I don't, I don't, I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't 
did it, man. Maybe we have to leave and come back? She was like, leave, you know, leave. Go back to where you came from. Didn't say anything about not coming back. So what happens now that I've returned? What troubles thee to link thy duty is all, and thy duty return from whence, for that is thy plague. I'll be sure, but... Now, for that is... Now, for that... What the fuck, man? I don't get it. I don't get it. We looked upstairs already. There is one thing inside the cold pain. Stray from the withering flame. <laughs> there is one in stra So snow will fall swallow you whole. Okay. There was a ladder over there that I didn't see before, but that doesn't really do that much for me. There's a mess of buildings down there, but there's no way to get to them. That I've seen, anyway. Which admittedly does not necessarily mean much. Oh, there's multiple ladders over here, which I didn't see. Okay. Those are next to impossible to see, admittedly. Let's go use this bonfire so we can, uh... Spawn here, as opposed to the other one. Then we'll try the ladder. Yeah, there's no way you would see this unless you were coming from the other direction, so I guess that might... You like the intention is you're supposed to go over there and then see the ladder on your, on your way back over so that you'll know what the hell you're doing but it seems a little odd to put it there to be honest okay this looks like it goes down into the village so this is maybe the way we're supposed to go so what about this other ladder that was over here because there was another one over this direction somewhere Oh, hi, bug things. I totally saw you there. You're not hiding. You're not hiding. If you think you're hiding, you're wrong. It was definitely another... It was definitely another... ladder, I thought. Although I could be wrong. I thought it was over here somewhere. There it is. How the fuck do I get to that? No, but actually, how do I get to that? Yeah, no way I'll survive that. No, but really, how do I get to that? <laughs> I don't... I don't know... what to do now. I mean, I'd just go this way, I guess, but... Doesn't seem to be anywhere else I know, so... I guess we'll go this way. Dude, don't even try. Wasting your time and mine. Just, just seriously, don't, don't even... don't, don't bother. Well, that's a one-way ticket.
You can slide if you wanna. Leave your friends behind. I don't know. I'm gonna try to make the rules on, but it really wasn't working. So I give up. Oh, how did it get so dark all of a sudden? I don't approve of mysterious darkness coming out of nowhere. It's no, it's no bueno. That is definitely a place that you can go down there. Looks like. Again, this looks like. In a lot, a lot of ways, looks like the uh, the one area from the one DLC from Dark Souls Two. Uh, the wa the ice one. It's similar in a lot of ways. And I think they do, they do kind of like to, uh, like, sneakily link things together a lot of times, so I do wonder if there's some sort of actual connection beyond just, you know, it's a nice area. You know, the basic thematic ness of the thing is obvious, but, oh, it's one of them things. It's one of them things. Oh, are you? I wonder. Do you have some sort of relationship to the giant trees with the same kind of hair? I don't know. Let me put that connection together because I haven't seen one of you anytime recently. But well, I'm just gonna snipe you. I don't trust trying to go down there and encounter you. About these things, are they alive? Oh, so they are. Well, you're terrifying. I don't think I want anything to do with you. What about the other little, bo little bodies? You're alive. We're alive is the key word. Okay. Seems a mildly scary just because they're really weird and ugly looking, but... I thought you might be alive, but now you're dead. There's definitely more of you alive down there. No interest in fighting you, though, so you're just not going to. You guys die really easy, though. You guys definitely die really easily. Which I'm actually a little concerned about, to be honest with you. Ooh, what the fuck was that? There's all this screeching going on. None of that. None of the screeching stuff that you're doing. Uh oh, big one. Better than deal with the big one. Don't trust the big one to not do some really freaky crap that we probably don't want anything to do with. You look like you are a bunch of baby birds, but you're like baby birds that were like born rather than hatched, which is freaky, but that would way to help you out there, friend. Oh, you got something. What did you got? Uh, whatever. Never mind. How the crap are you supposed to get to that? Maybe you can jump to it from there? I wouldn't hold my breath, but... God, you're so noisy! Shut up! Hmm. I don't like it. Don't like it at all. Looks like a trap to me. It's because it is a trap. What the shit are you? I'm shooting it.
Rather weaken it a little bit before it comes gets close enough to attack me. Oh, you're a fast fucker, whatever you are. Yep, fast. Very fast. Also now very dead. Oh, you almost got away even 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 when I was preparing to hit you with my strong attack there, you still almost managed to dodge it. I'm actually very concerned though there's gonna be like five of them things dropping down from above on onto my face. Very concerned. Very concerned indeed. I wonder if that was like the full growing version of these things. Or like the version that didn't get mutated or something. I don't fucking know. It's freaky, whatever it is. This is one that's like standing up. Eh, that's not concerning at all. Totally not concerning at all. Totally looks like it's a boss area. Probably because it is. Okay, can't get there. Gotta work our way through these really weird buildings with looks of things. Uh, the reviews that I've read for this for this DLC actually have not really been that great. Um, generally, the consensus was it's been fun, but um, it's not necessarily that good of content. Fun, but short. Yes. Oh. oh, finally, you have come. Oh, wondrous Ash, grant us our wish. Make the tales true, and burn this world away. My lady must see flame, and you have only to show her. You are Ash, are you not? Is it not fire that you see? I mean, yeah. Surely you'll see Rot that afflicts your world. But that which fooled the good father and buried the flame mm -hmm. after we had all made up our minds. So, I just one wish make the turn tales, the world away. My lady must. Oh, I am so terribly frightened of timidly rotting away like those. Like those fools on the outside. Oh, I am like. Yeah, okay, dude. You're a little bit freaky, not gonna lie. And your associates are just as freaky as you, if not worse. So you guys. Okay. There's definitely a lizard here somewhere. I just don't know where. So are you guys gonna like attack me or oh, you're gonna attack, I think. Very badly, might I add. You're gonna try and attack me, but you're gonna do a horrible job at it. Dude over there, this, this that one right there is just like chilling. We ain't paying any damage. Where the fuck are you all going? Okay. That's not concerning at all. Not at all. Totally is concerned. Yeah, this is one of the complaints that a lot of people had is the uh, there's too many bonfires and I kind of agree with them to a degree I like that there's so many bonfires in a way for the precise reason that it's also not a good thing 
Um, which is I do. I don't mind it as much as a lot of people would. I can definitely see the complaint. And that is, this is just too many of them. It makes it too easy. Okay. Apparently there's stuff outside this building and there's stuff on top of the building. How the hell am I supposed to get to it? Because I sure as hell don't see any way on top of this place. Well, there must be a way up there somehow, but... You guys are all just dying away. Let's head over to the side. Oh, okay. That was too noisy. Be silent. Okay, um, this this area is kind of annoying. Let's just all you know, attack me. No? Let's go and chill. If you guys are chill, I'm chill. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh boy over here and not not chill. Oh boy over here spitting acid or some shit at me. Oh, you're like throwing up on me or something. I don't fucking know about that. Hey, ugly. Stop that shit. First house we've actually been able to get into. All the rest of them have been locked off. That's the other thing is they they're giving me large quantities of like the uh, you know the the usable souls uh, that you can use to get more souls and stuff, but I don't need those like for anything. They're just giving them to me for like no real reason. It's just like oh, we heard you like souls. Have some souls. It's like, what, what, but, but why? I think we're trying to grab it. We just like a really bad job of it. I mean, maybe not, but that's that's what I feel like was trying to, you were trying to do there. So good again, another soul. Like why why? You are really crappy enemies. Like the enemies in the rest of this DLC have been mean. You guys are not. You're just cannon fodder. Assuming I have to jump to that from here, because I don't see any other way to get to it. And if there is, I'll be fucked if I know how. There is some other means to get to it. I will be fucked if I know what that that means is. So I guess we'll try it. Doesn't really seem like a I'm trying to remember what the buttons are for for this. Again, it has been a while since I played this game until I started playing it again here recently. For the purposes of the DLC. Crow quills. What the crap is that? Uh what is this? It has a very unique look to it, so I should be able to find it easy enough. There we go. Special thrusting sword. Okay. Uh, wielded by Corvian knights and a special paired weapon with twin handed brand. When twin handed, brandish four thin edge blades in the left hand. What? Infatuation with Sister Frey, the Corvian Knight swore to protect the painting from fire and to this end took to the execution of their own brethren. Simultaneously throw temporarily substantial illusions of the four thin-edged blades wielded in the left hand. Okay. Okay, so you can use it like a, uh... Yep, 
Interesting. I kind of like it, actually. It'll bear a good deal of uh, upgrading for it to be any use. Since obviously it's a level 1 weapon and I'm on New Game Plus at this point, so... A level 1 weapon is going to be crap no matter how good it is at this particular point in time, just because, you know, I am not, I am too far advanced in the game for that to be useful at this stage, but, but, having said that, Geronimo, bitch. Okay, see once again, that was like a good spot for like unique loot or something and they just stuck, you know, loot that we've seen before. That's another one of my problems with this, is they could put more interesting loot in and they just, they're just using souls and things that are really not that interesting. I mean, sure, sure, you can only have so many weapons and so many things in a DLC, or, you know, in the game in general, without, uh, you know, just getting too many, or, you know, not being able to... Oh, he's wielding the thing I'm wielding. Interesting. Ow, fuck! You guys are gonna attack me? He's wielding that weapon. That's pretty cool. I like that there's an enemy who's actually using it. It's neat. I think, it, I think his version of the weapon hurts more than mine does, at least right now, though. Ow, holy shit, that hurt. Can't even turn my back on him to try to retreat from him because he's got the ranged attack with it, which is neat, and I like. I think that weapon, that makes the weapon really good uh, for, like, PvP and stuff, because it'll make it, you know, you won't be able to retreat from a person who's wielding it very easily, because they can hit you as you're trying to run away. So I like that. Are you trying to attack me now? Apparently you are. So what, you all went from being peaceful, friendly people to now you want to kill me? Or is that only some of you? Apparently that's only some of you. I don't know what you want from me. The dude was trying to kill all of you. So I killed him. I don't know what your problem is. I'm trying to help you guys out. Home Slice was trying to kill you. Point of that area is. Oh, there's stuff down below there. What the crap are you? Don't, I'm not entirely sure I want the answer to that question. Oh, hi. Oh, bye! I think that was actually the entire point of you. I think you were supposed to. Uh, I think he was supposed to and intended to uh, end up hitting me and kicking me off the cliff with you. I think that's what you were trying to do there. Pretty sure that's what you were trying to do there. Not 100% certain about that, but. Ow, poison. Okay. No, not letting you do that again. Definitely not letting you get another attack of that of that in again. See, again, another large soul. And again, I'm not really complaining. I'm not saying that's like bad loot necessarily. I just feel like they could have done better loot. not necessarily bad loot, it's just it could have been better. 
think it's a failed opportunity to introduce some, like, new, something more interesting than that. It's not bad, necessarily, but... You just could have done better, and you didn't. And that's the part I'm disappointed about. Deal with it. Mages! We had like bloody crazy assassin beastie before, and now you got mages. Oh, whoa, whoa! Ah, what the fuck? Did you just hit me with an attack through the fucking floor? Obsidian in your case, whatever the hell it was. Especially through a wall. I don't know what the hell you're shooting at there, friend, but I'm not sure you know either. Surprise! That hurt, didn't it? Good. One can only hope. Bye bye. Thanks for coming, friends. I like playing archers. I'm a very archer, I'm a very ranged oriented character in a lot of RPGs, and this is frankly no exception, even though the ranged weapons in this game are leave a lot to be desired. But in Dark Souls 2, and also in this one, I used ranged weapons fairly extensively. Oh, why am I selecting on this one? I don't want this one. This weapon is not the weapon to be using. Are you trying to get away? No, 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 no. Crap. Oh, this guy. Inside. Aha. That's gonna be it for this episode. Because... <laughs> We're about at the, the length anyway. So I will see you next time. Uh, I will basically try to pick up more or less where we just were so we don't, you don't have to watch me go back through all the area that we've already done. Uh, so I will endeavor to return to, uh, ba again, basically to the point that we were at already. So yeah, you have a different weapon. You are not wielding the same thing that the other the other one was wielding. And I don't know what the one that just killed me was had on, because I didn't get to really look at him. Didn't really get to look at that guy. You, I'm just going to kill with ranged attacks, because I'm afraid that you will find some way up here, or that I'll have to go back down there again. And I don't want to deal with you. A lot. And now you're dead. Damn it, you dropped something. Fuck. He's now to go down there. Crap. Nothing that I wanted. When you dropped something, I thought maybe it was something good. It wasn't. Okay, folks. So, like I was saying, I will see you in the next one. So take it easy, have a good day, and thanks for watching. Oh, I didn't realize it was stuff above. Oh. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.